Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play This War Mine. And last we left off, I believe Winter actually has taken hold. I'm not sure what differences this has in gameplay, I guess I'll find out soon, but, uh... I'm gonna guess I have to keep a lot of, you know, wood on the fire, which I, last I remember, I think I, uh... Put wood on the fire before we went to bed, or well, before Pava went out, you know, looking for stuff, but... Holy hell, he got a lot of good stuff last time, I forgot all about that. Where did he go? Seriously, where'd he go? I don't remember. Okay, we need to put more on that now. Alright. Pavel, you can... We need to eat. That's Marco, he's still sick. Alright, no, we can... This is fine. It works. So, now that everything's warm, Katya, you are not tired. Uh, you're sad. Well, I guess you can go down and turn on the radio. Meanwhile... Start cooking, Bruno. We need to eat again. Oh, but we ate three days ago. Yeah, I know. I know. We gotta eat again, though. Something about humans wanting to eat every day or something. I don't know. Bless the radio. What? If you melt snow for water, make sure to boil it before drinking. Alright, well, if I need water, I guess I can go out and get snow. Unfortunately, higher temperatures are not expected over the next couple days. Alright. That's the second one. That's some classical music. And where's the fourth one? Oh. Sniper fire, mortar shells, and cold temperatures. Let's see. Civilian casualties are the result of tragic accidents. Hmm. Alright, let's put it back on classical music. There we go. You can play the guitar, Katya. I don't think it'll help much, but... Uh... Marco, you gotta get ready to go eat, man. You can't get better without eating. At least that's what my mother always told me when I was sick. Always made me eat. Usually chicken noodle soup, which made me cough a lot more. Yes, I'm the I'm the guy that just said, that's just gonna make me cough. So, I guess I'm, you know, not the best for that. I guess I should give Marco, while he's up, the, uh... You know, the, the medicine. But while he's here, let's have him set another trap, and off we go. I love that I can find fertilizer now, but Marco's gonna eat, then take some herbal medicine. Then when Pavel gets up, he'll eat. You're tired, so you can go to sleep. Is Katya tired? No, so yeah, alright. Take some herbal meds, man. You deserve it. You're our star, you know, uh, gatherer, so yeah, you do that. And then when Pavel gets up, who's tired? Oh, great. Well, Katya, you're done playing. You're gonna go trade now. And then, I guess you can go down here, get ready to go sleep whenever he gets up. And we'll trade here, actually, before you trade. Uh, what? Okay, oh, no, don't close the door. Marco, I don't remember ever telling you to come up here. <laughs> Alright, what do we have here that I might want? I need that, but what do I have to trade is the good question. Do I really need all these? Oh, I guess I don't want to give away parts. I'd kind of be dumb now, wouldn't it? Do we need coffee? I don't think we really need coffee, but it's not. It's pretty common, though, so it's not going to get me a whole lot. Jesus Christ, you only take one? No, that's no, 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 no. That's not a good deal at all. What would it be without Katya? No, you don't get one for one. You don't get anything for coffee if you don't have Katya here. Let's see. I don't plan on ever using these herbs, but that's common too, so that's not going to help matters. What, am I going to get five of these? Oh, I actually got... Yeah, that's not worth it at all. Not doing that. What can I trade for components? Damn it. I need components. I, I could get rid of this stuff, but that's common. Common. Nothing special. Nothing special. Good lord. I'm not giving away my fuel, I'll tell you that now. I really don't want to trade away books, and it's common anyway. What do you need, man? Oh, you need bandages. Well, I have nine of them. Go ahead, take one. Just give me all the components you have. All of them, I say. And some water while you're at it. Okay, fine. No water. You drive a hard bargain, Franco. Drive a hard bargain. Alright, so. What else do I need in here? 
probably could use water, but if I have things right here, I don't really want to just take water. <laughs> you know, it kind of seems kind of stupid. I'll buy some water from you. You have water right here that you can just boil. Yes, but I'm lazy. On the plus side, I probably, I'm not on the plus side. On the other side, I probably do need fuel because fuel is going very quickly. I'm using like six a day. I really need more fuel. So I need the, I need, I need lumber. Lumber I can turn into fuel. Maybe. Yeah, I know I can. I just, it takes a while to do it. Oh, that's great. All right. Do I need anything else before I send you on your way? Um, not really. I can turn the fuel. I well, no, I don't think we really need anything else. All right, we're done. Uh, Katya, you need to go eat, hon. Okay, and Pavel, when he gets up, he can go eat. And you are supposed to be downstairs getting ready to sleep, not up here looking at Katya trading. I know you interested in how the process works, but you don't need to do that. Katya, go back to playing the guitar. And then, Pavel, you go eat. I'm not doing this whole food conservation all that well. I know I'm not, but oh well. Vegetables will be done probably next tomorrow, I would say. Well, you're not getting another helping. You don't need it. Okay, now, what was Marco doing up there? There we go. Or down there. Yeah, go up there. Is anybody else tired? He's tired. She's not. No, I didn't. No, damn it. No, you keep playing. He's not tired. She's not tired. The only one tired is Bruno. Right. All right, well, Pavel, you send him away. We don't need him sitting out there all day. And while we're at it, let's try and get some of the snow, man. Yeah, it's snow, man. We can melt it into water. Alright, fine. That's, uh... Three, I guess. It's gonna take an hour. Bruno, then... Well... Where's the radio at? Go sit in the comfy chair. Now, I'm sure that's probably taking all my heat away, just by leaving the door open. I don't want to just leave the door open. No, I guess the door was closed. Put more on the fire. And now we can go back in here, get some more water using the snow, I think. Oh, you need that too. Oh man, that is nasty. Oh, well, you do get four water though. I was gonna say that is nasty amount of stuff you need to you need, but I I guess I can it gets me eight water, so that'll be fine. If I want to keep having vegetables and you know you know water to eat, I need to make some sacrifices. Plus, I can make more fuel with the wood I traded for, so that should be fine. Plus, I can also make more filters. So, Katya, instead of just sitting there feeling sorry for yourself playing the guitar, let's actually get something done. Alright, Pavel, while you're up there... I guess that's Katya's turn. I was gonna say, while you're up there, make some more fuel. But, alright, make some filters. We need probably a couple more filters. And you should make some... Fuelly hell, we have 61 lumber. <laughs> oh, that's new. I'll take one and a half hours. Should be fine. Don't really need wood for anything else, so I think we're gonna be nice and cozy in here. Oh, yes. It's like a battle of... I don't know, it's like attrition. I've set myself up for the long haul, and I think it's starting to pay for itself. Especially since somebody said I might actually live through this. Which, I don't know if that's a rarity or not, but it still makes me feel good that apparently I'm doing something right. <laughs> Alright, Katya, while you're up here, actually... Can we can we actually use this during the winter months? I wouldn't think you could because the water would freeze, wouldn't it? It's just snow. Yeah, but we can melt with snow. Alright, I didn't think we could, but... Alright. Katya, I want you to sit over here in case by t when at like 7.50 that goes down to 5. I don't want that to happen. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh. All right, it's still at six by time. The all right. He's on meds. I still don't want to send him out in the middle of winter night well, when he's sick. So he's gonna be sleeping in bed. And I want him. I want Marco back to full. Damn it! I don't want him getting worse. 
Everybody's sad. Mm-hmm. Well, is there any place we can trade to maybe help somebody out? I would rather not go there if I didn't have to. Mm. Let's see, occupy the vestry. Oh yeah, let's go there. They don't want to trade. I'm not stealing anymore right now. We're all sad as it is. Can't get there due to snow. Oh great, so at least this time... It's not fighting. You just can't be bothered to trudge through the snow. Okay, fine. I guess it's either the supermarket, the construction site, or the military. I guess we could even go to the church, but... Mm. It's probably not... It's probably best not to get in their way. Well, I guess we can go to... The church. And we'll send Pavel. He's our... He's our red shirt. If you don't know what a red shirt is, the person that's the most disposable, he's, uh, yeah, yeah that's him. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, he's the one that if he does get into a really bad situation, he can hopefully get out of it just by running, like a, you know, a coward, but, yeah, I guess we'll go to St. Mary's Church then. I, wait, do I need anything here? So a shovel might come in handy. Oh, good thing I read that. You need a shovel, son. There you go. You're welcome, and you might need that too in case there's somebody there. Probably shouldn't send you in there unarmed though, so... We're not gonna have very much space to get stuff, but I think that should be fine. I don't want Pavel to die, that's the main thing. Pavel dies, we're in some... Well, we're not really in trouble, but... Oh, well, good, I guess that... Familiarity's good, oh my word. This is a completely new area. Don't really want that. I'd probably better go this way. It's probably the only way I can go. That's probably blocked down there, knowing my luck. Oh dear. This is gonna require stealth. These people supposedly have guns. I hear gunfire, and I probably shouldn't be up in the middle of nothing. With it. This is so open. What if there's people down there with guns? There's no doors. There's no walls. There's no nothing. I can't see Jack. I see somebody with a gun. That's always good. Uh, this place scares the bejesus out of me. We're going back this way. Now. I'd rather go lower and just hopefully drop... Oh, crap, if I drop down, how am I going to get back up? That's the problem. Alright, fine. We're just pussyfooting around here, not getting anything done. That's not good. But I don't want him to die. Uh, why did I have to come here? Why couldn't I have gone to... I don't know, the supermarket. This isn't gonna let me through it, is it? No. No, you pretty much have to go this way. Friggin' hell. Well, I can't say I didn't try and do things the stealthy way. So let's just drop on in and hopefully this guy doesn't mind. No, 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 don't run. For God's sake, do not run. There's a man with a gun. No, don't, God damn it, don't, don't run. Left click. I did not say right click. That was a left click. You jackass. Oh, now right click's the opposite now? This opposite day? There we go. Jesus Christ, that's not the time to have your controls just go opposite day. It wasn't even like I was double clicking. Double clicking can make you go faster, but... Okay, he's just gonna stay occupied there. That's what that's our hope. If he doesn't, Pavel's dead, from the looks of it. So you know. Discretion is pretty important here. Because if I'm not discreet, well, Pavel takes a dirt nap, most likely. You know, I just realized I'm gonna have to get out of this. So I Jesus Christ, is that all that's here? That? That's all? I don't want that. Give me something decent. No, you just keep giving me gunpowder. The thing I just said I didn't want. Thanks for that. I appreciate it. Oh, good lord. Not where I... Not where I want to be. I'm in the middle of nothing. <laughs> I'm taking all this. I don't need it, but I'm taking it because I need something to show for what I got here. I need something to show, yeah. 
A broken assault rifle. I'll definitely take that. Oh, uh, there's no way in hell I'm going that way, I'll tell you that. I'll go down here. Hopefully there's no one down here. Because if I go over that way... Oh, God, he's not in sis... Oh, my Jesus. Oh, this might be bad. Oh, man. Oh, this could be very bad. I don't know where he is. Oh. Um, oh, my. If he's right above me, he'll hear me shoveling. I can't leave. If I don't leave, I Pavel could die. Crap, I have to go a really long way back if I don't go that way. I should have brought a gun, not a knife. Uh, can you, like, only go halfway up the... No. Oh, we're going to do some fancy footwork here. Oh, no. How do I get... Oh, Lord. The only way out is over here. That's it, man. <laughs> That's the only way out. And my only hope? Possibly killing a man to get out. Not my priority. I really don't want to kill again. Uh, please don't. Up. We gotta start heading back. That's where's he at? That's my priority. I want to know where he is so I don't run into him. All right, now is a good time to get out. Hopefully, do it quietly. We didn't get much for our trouble, but I I, I prize stealth more than you know loot in this situation. That was the first time where I genuinely feel I felt like yes, somebody's gonna die here. So, you know, I, I panic. I panic a lot in games like this. I don't, in roguelikes, I'm very conservative. I'm not gung-ho with people's lives. Maybe that's a bad thing. Maybe it's a pussy thing. That's what I do. Better to come back and scrounge another day. I should have bought all, I should have picked up all that powder, but. All right, we learned if we go back in there, we need a gun. At the least. I really don't want to get into a firefight either, but I've, it's better than a knife.